Hey everybody! I hope everybody had a great 4th of July weekend, those of my friends who live in the USA. You know, I said I wanted to watch fireworks this weekend, and I didn't get to watch a single one. Excuse me. It rained Saturday and Sunday both. The only, in fact, the only fireworks I watched were Ninja Jesse ones and Tweetness's uh, videos. They had fireworks, and so uh, I watched both their videos and saw some cool fireworks. You know, my neighbors didn't even put on a, any fireworks out. So I guess it was because of the weather. I really don't know, but it was a good fourth. Besides that, I cooked way too much. I always do. We always eat way too much. We always do. Every single holiday we do. The only good thing about cooking all that stuff is that you have leftovers, you know. You can go back and eat, and I don't have to cook the next day. And if I tell you it's a shame, you cook for two or three days for a holiday, and then... You sit down to eat, and what, it, what does it take, 20, 30 minutes? I tell you what, I cooked this weekend, I didn't even want to eat it. <laughs> James went ahead and sat down and ate, and he said, you going to eat? I said, I'll eat later. I just, it just wears me out. <laughs> oh, but I did eat, you know. But, um, so I hope y'all had a good uh, holiday. Uh, I have one new sub. Their name is the Queen Pawn, and their um, a link will be over there. I wanted to tell you all last week I mentioned something about a place called Less Vlog, and I got an account over there because of um, the way you. I really don't. You, I tell you what, I don't know how long YouTube's gonna last. I hope it lasts forever and ever. But are you all having problems with videos loading up and? Stuff like that. Well, I am. My son's having trouble with and He don't even want to watch YouTube anymore because of it. But I know when I try to load a video, if it's a long one, you know, that little thing just goes round and round and round. And then I'll watch two or three uh, seconds of it. It'll stop. And so what I've been doing is I've been, you know, clicking on the video and then pushing the arrow to stop it and just let the whole thing load up and then watch it. And just about every video I watch is like that now. So, I went and got an account over at letsvlog.com. Basically, too, I wanted to have another place to uh, store my videos and to establish myself into a new place. Not that I wanted to leave YouTube. I don't. I love YouTube. I've met so many good people here. But, I tell you what, how long is it going to last? They're losing millions of dollars every month. But anywho, so I went over there today. You know what? They shut that place down. <sighs> over some kind of drama or whatever. <laughs> I don't really know what happened, but, uh, you know. I don't guess there'll ever be another YouTube. I don't know what people's going to do, but I'm so afraid YouTube's going to start charging us, too. You know, I, I just don't know. But anywho, they shut that place down. I just can't believe it. Well, James was off last week and uh, went back to work today. And uh, I believe I've caught a cold. I have sneezed like crazy. And it's because he wants the air conditioner down on 40. Hold on, I'm itching. <laughs> but he wanted that air conditioner and he just said, I, he told me I was killing him because I had the air conditioner up too high. Well, he's had it down so low that I believe I've caught a code, a little head code. I feel like I got a little bit of sore throat and sinus, so, you know. And he told me that he wanted to get a, a, a window air conditioner for the master bedroom. You know, I know it is a little bit warmer upstairs than it is downstairs, but golly, Ned's downstairs is like ice cubes. So I don't know what he's going to do. I hope he doesn't get a stupid window unit. I'll just never come up here. <laughs> but okay, last time I talked, I said I was going to say something about Michael Jackson. Have you ever seen anything to beat your life? I tell you what. You know, he was sad. and, and I know he at one time he had the world. You know, it seemed like he did. That he could have anything he wanted. He was so talented. And I tell you what, just 
If that's what fame does to people, I don't want to ever be famous. I do not. They can't go nowhere. They can't do anything without people in their business constantly. And I know that's a one price of fame, but I really think he was sort of messed up as a kid. Do you know what I mean? Because he, just like he said, he never had a childhood and his father made him work and all those boys. And I think every one of them is a little bit strange. I really do. But I feel sorry for, I feel sorry for him in a way. Of course, he's dead now. It doesn't matter. But, you know, I don't know if he's a child molester. I don't know. I don't know nothing about that. Sometimes I think, yeah, he was. And sometimes I think, no, he wasn't. I don't know. But can you see the mess that is happening right now with his kids, his money, his his uh, estate and all the oh, we haven't seen it yet. I tell you what, there's going to be fights and fusses, family fighting each other, and who's going to get hurt is those kids, and they're probably all messed up too. So I just hate that it's all going to be played out in public, and everybody's going to see. I would be ashamed if that was my family. I would. I would be ashamed because you know. I guess Michael Jackson took care of his whole crew, all his family. I don't really, except for Janet. I guess she's a multimillionaire in her own right, but who knows what all went wrong in that family and what happened in that family. It's just sad. It's, uh, it's sad, and I am so glad I'm not famous. I'm so glad nobody in my family is famous. That's just like winning the lottery. I tell you what, I wouldn't want to win the lottery. I wouldn't want to. I tell you why, it's because everybody in the everybody in the world's gonna be your relative. Then, people coming out of the woodwork wanting money. Well, you'd never have a moment's peace. There's a guy in West Virginia that won three hundred some million dollars, and I tell you what, everything in the world's happened to that man. I guess he's broke now. He was a millionaire before he even won, and his family, his grandchildren have died of drug overdoses and oh my lord it's just a he's been arrested I don't know how many times he's been arrested and it's just a mess look at John and Kate I've never watched that show but just things I've heard look what their life is you know I just I feel sorry for people that get famous and can't handle it if I ever got famous for like winning the lottery or something like that, I don't play the lottery but just I would go away and nobody would know who I was. I would. I would just... Anywho, enough of that. I'll, I'll have a 20 minute video. I'll probably have to cut half this stuff out. But, I just want to check in with you guys. I did make a video of me singing. I posted it over there on Tune Crooner. So if y'all want to see it, I've got the link over there. But I'm just checking in on you. See how y'all doing. This is Melissa reporting from Up in the Holler. Bye, everybody.